uh, ladies and gentlemen, distinguished guests, uh, I am truly uh, delighted to be uh, back here in India. Uh, I was shocked when one of my colleagues told me that it's been 12 years since my last visit, and I, I honestly felt it was only seven years. But now I think uh, this empowers us to hopefully make this more of an annual event, because I see the synergies between our two nations being so important, as well as the opportunities uh, that both countries offer to each other. So on behalf of uh, not only uh, the Jordanian delegation, but uh, our uh, colleagues from uh, the public and the private sector from Jordan, uh, some young students uh, from, from our country that have joined us on this trip, we are truly delighted to be here at the very warm and, and, and hospitable uh, welcome that has been given to us since our arrival. Um, today, I, I would like to uh, take this opportunity to um, thank the uh, Federation of Indian Chambers of Commerce and Industry, the Confederation of Indian Industry, the Associate Chambers of Commerce and Industry of India, and obviously um, the Government of India for making this trip uh, so successful. Um, I was about to read my notes, but most, most of the stuff has been covered uh, by, by, by others. So I just wanted to say how important it is for our nations to take this opportunity to move uh, our relationship forward. And this forum uh, this morning, uh, I hope, was an example where good ideas could have been exchanged and uh, new avenues opened. Uh, as my Excellency, uh, the, my dear colleague, uh, mentioned, uh, uh, Jordan is situated with the opportunity for uh, not only the free trade agreements for North America, but Europe, the Middle East, and the new development of uh, our opening relationship with East Africa, uh, I think has uh, some opportunities for many people in this room that we discussed this with a few of you um, earlier on. But at the same time, uh, because we are developing very much uh, not only uh, our agribusiness, but also our ICT uh, sectors, uh, I see a lot of opportunities for Jordanian companies to come here and work with their brothers and sisters um, in this country. Um, I do hope that, uh, as uh, we have announced, uh, that the uh, uh, opportunities for uh, your uh, countrymen and women to come to Jordan has been facilitated. Uh, but at the same time, I asked our very, your very capable ambassador in Amman that any challenges that uh, Indians have coming to our borders, uh, please let the embassy know. We in the Royal Court will personally look into it to make sure that the smoothest uh, welcome is given to our Indian compatriots. Um, we have many challenges ahead of us, and as it was alluded to, uh, uh, with the instability that the world has given us, uh, fortunately, with, uh, uh, with uh, difficult people that we have to deal with, uh, it is more important that people of different cultures and different backgrounds uh, energize each other to come closer together. Uh, and I believe that uh, our two-day visit here in India will be the new start of the relationship between our two countries. I'm truly delighted uh, to be back here. Uh, and I'm truly delighted for the warm welcome that I've been received uh, since my arrival. And I look forward to a new strong chapter of relationships between our two nations. Thank you so much for your hospitality. Uh, let's get things done. Uh, and please uh, do not be bashful with our ministers here. Tell them exactly what you think and what you need, and uh, we will follow up to make sure it happens. Thank you all very much.